My next guest is a lengthy and varied resume. She is an author, an actor, a director, a dancer, a talent agent, product pitch woman, and a sports radio personality who has been inducted into four different halls of fame. And as recently as last year, she was the number one porn star in the world. Please give a warm hand, although most of you have probably already have, to Lisa Ann. <laughs> Very nervous. Uh, I'll be so. sitting next to Lisa. Yeah, that, that, I don't that, want the, I, we're not at the movies. We don't need the extra seat in between us. We just sit like this. Hey. Lisa, I hate to do this, but first, first things first. I, I have a poncho for you because we have a very horny audience. Uh, yeah. I just want to. I get it. It's kind of my everyday. At least once a day, somebody walks up to me praising how happy they are to tell me that they masturbate to me every single day, and that I also need to give them a photo. It's never, can I please have? Right. Would you mind taking? Yo, you need to give me a photo. I jerk off to you every day. Like, it's just like, all right. That with the hundred plus cock shots I wake up to every day in my email, text, and yeah. timeline. Yeah, but the poncho is this about is, right. This is it's about right. I should just start digital, walking in. Walking in a digital poncho, maybe. Yeah, why not? Why not? You get a hundred cock shots a day. I mean, this is. They're not pretty penises either. If I was going to send cock shots, I would go and find like the best looking one that maybe was already retouched on like browsers or something. Yeah. Like, hit nicely, full background, you know? And I'd take that one. Why would you send your actual one that looks really fucking weird? No. Why is it that color? Why is it so many colors? I have so many colors. If they're really weird, I send them to my friends while they're working with the important message like, help, I'm stranded on a trip in the subject. Then it's like, Cox. That is, I mean, as someone who's never sent a dick, well, that's, I, should, I should back up. I did actually send a dick pic once. Uh, to, 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 to your girlfriend. doctor to have something observed. Like, is this serious, doc? No, it was to it was to a girlfriend, ex-girlfriend that we were trying to spice things up. You know, I thought it might send it. It totally backfired. Do any ladies in the room really think it's necessary to look at a penis that's not attached to anything? Does it do anything for you? Anything? It, it annoys you more than anything. It feels that if it's a date that hasn't gone to like the third date, he's stepped over the line. You're a little bit fucking creeped out by him. It's just. It's weird. Do you, have you ever sent a dick pic? <laughs> I'm, I'm still thinking about what he said. No, I, uh, I've never done it. If, if, you'll, if you'll let me finish, let me finish my joke. If you let me finish my joke, I, uh, I, I sent a dick pic to ex-girlfriend and it totally backfired. Um, she was arrested for possession of child porn. <laughs> I've never actually sent a dick pic. Would never yeah, in a million okay. years do that. That would be insane. I get it. Um, you get it. It's funny. It's good. Yeah. It's good. <laughs> to make me think now that I realize I don't have any age gates, so I don't know how old the ones I've been looking at. Now I'm fucking freaked out. <laughs> now I have to delete them all. Yeah.